In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Bluehost to FileZilla. It's really easy and straightforward, but pay close attention. So let's get right into it. So first of all, we need to log into our Bluehost hosting and the dashboard looks something like this. Now, if you haven't actually got Bluehost or you haven't got a plan, you can click the link at the top of the description. You'll get 75% off and a free domain. So it only costs you £1.55 per month. So do that and then you should come back to this. So once we get to here, what we're going to do is we're going to go over to the hosting section and we're going to scroll down and there's a button here that says cPanel. So I'm just going to click on cPanel here. It's going to open up a new tab that looks something like this. Now, once we've done this, we need to go down to where it says files and we need to go over here to FTP accounts. So I'm going to click on that there and it should open up a new tab. And in here, we're going to be asked to make a login. So first of all, the login should just be like a username. So I'm just going to put info next to the domain. There's the domain we want to send it to. I'm just going to use this one. Next, we need to set up a password and we need to set up another password in here, which is the same password, obviously. Then the directory, we can just leave that as blank as that. The quota, we can set how much is the maximum we can send or we can just put unlimited. And then we can click create FTP account. So now once we click create, it will show up here. We can click configure FTP client. Then our FTP username is this one here. The FTP server is this one here. FTP and explicit FTPS port is this. And obviously the um, password is one that you made. So then you can go ahead, put that into your FileZilla and you should be able to connect. It's very easy and simple to do. So if you enjoyed the video and found it useful, be sure to like and subscribe and comment down below that it helped. Thank you for watching.